So I've rebuilt the uh, circuit for the uh, HID, the human uh, detector here. So this, this little device detects the uh, presence of a person based on infrared light. So when it sees infrared light, it'll, it'll switch on a lamp here. And as I pass through the uh, detector, it shows up here, the LED here. LED lights up when I pass by, which uh, lights up the uh, lamp here. And then there's an ambient light detector here, which is a photo transistor that detects the uh, presence of light. So this detector here is the HC-SR501 uh, detector. Also, it's also called the DYP-ME003 uh, sensor module. The uh, connector is just a three-pin three-pin connector here. That you use a, a connector that you can get out of a CD-ROM drive, like a CD-ROM audio connector. Just plug it in here, and when it senses the presence of a person, it lights up. Okay, so um, it's power transistor. Let me. Um, let me go through uh, with, well, here, here's the sensor, here's the uh, in indicator for the sensor, uh, the timing capacitor, resistor, a uh, photo transistor, adjustment for the photo transistor to adjust the sensitivity of light that uh, that will turn off the uh, lamp here. Um, just draw, let's switch it off actually, and then I'll just draw the uh, circuit diagram. So the red LED indicates the presence of a person here, so. So, let's just draw that, let's see. So first is the uh, sensor, the uh, SRC501 uh, sensor. It's, it, it, yeah, the SR, uh, the, the HC-SR501 sensor. Okay, so you got the sensor module. module there and it's got three pins the red one those are the positive the black one negative ground and the white one is the output which puts out a 3.3 volts and about 10 milliamps So what I did was one for the indicator. 
I placed a uh, transistor, an NPN transistor. You can find them in Radio Shack, or whatever. And it just, all it does is just uh, amplifies the uh, signal from the uh, sensor uh, into an LED. Okay. And then another transistor. And then PN transistor here. Ground signal here. So the signal turns on this transistor. Okay. So this transistor amplifies a signal enough to charge a capacitor. Positive. Okay, this capacitor. I I placed a ten mega, ten uh, microfarad capacitor here. Okay, so this this is like a timer. This is a capacitor resistor timer. One mega ohm resistor. Okay, so this uh, res capacitor and resistor is the actual timing circuit, very right? basic timing circuit. Okay, so charge it. So when there's light, when the when the senses a person, presence of a person, it, it sends a signal. This transistor amplifies it charges the capacitor and the resistor slowly bleeds it out use a PNP transistor which is an amplifying transistor okay so it feeds a, a signal uh, it feeds us a, a small amount of uh, negative current to this PNP transistor Okay, so here we have another transistor. This is the uh, PNP transistor. This is the uh, TI. Well, I use the uh, TIP31. Uh, you can use any NPN transistor you want. Anyone will work. So it, it already this uh, NPN transistor amplifies the signal, amplifies the uh, signal from the uh, timer here. Okay, so this one, this is a uh, a power transistor that can power a load, which is like looks like this here. And it's got three pins. This one, uh, it's uh, the base here, collector, and emitter. P31. Okay, one with the little hole there, the heat sink. That's what this one is. And this got the load here. Positive. Okay, so this is the load. So this could be like a an LED that you saw there. The LED that lit up. This is the one with the heat sink, the transistor. The load is the uh, the round uh, LED array. Okay, so what's that? And what I did was. Put a, uh, a follow transistor to switch off the circuit when there's sunlight or any kind of light. So I placed uh, another uh, PNP transistor here. Okay, 
in case even if it goes to the positive and collector just directly here. It just all it does is just switches off the uh, load here. Yeah. Just switches off the load. Okay, so here I got the uh, a one mega ohm resistor here. Okay, that normally turns on the transistor so that it switches on the load, keeps the load on. And so what switches it off is the uh, full load transistor. Which what I did was put a 1 kilo ohm resistor here just to protect the circuit, just eliminating so keep a minimum resistance of one kilo ohm. And here's the photo dial, photo transistor. Actually, yeah. Uh, this way. And what else? Did, what I also did was added a another resistor here. It's a variable re resistor that's uh, 100k a potentiometer. Okay. So when there's sunlight, it just switch off the circuit. Because uh, positive will switch off the uh, PNP transistor, negative switches on. So when there's sunlight, it completes the circuit here from the positive and sends sends a positive to this PNP transistor, switches off and cuts off the load. So very basic um, circuitry here. Very basic. Uh, yeah, I mean, there's certainly much more efficient uh, circuits, but this is very basic, and it just works, so, that's the second version. Okay.